certainly you have things here that I've never come across. These uh, objects here that, well, kind of resemble fish hooks. Well, they are fish hooks. <coughs> hooks used by fishermen centuries ago. Is that so? Are any in use today? Well, some of them uh, would probably be found in remote areas. And, uh, well, I guess you have to admit, though, they're a far cry from the modern-day fishing tackle we're accustomed to. Not necessarily so. Take this Polynesian shell hook. Uh -huh. Probably used to catch bonita or some sort of bait. Not too different from the modern spoon, which we use to catch bonita or some sort of bait. Uh-huh, that's right. Basically, they are the same in design. You know, it'd be interesting to study the evolution of angling tackle. A good deal is known about it. The first tackle was probably a crude harpoon or spear. I see, and then uh, what comes next? Then barbs and hooks were added onto the spearhead, as indicated here. Mm -hmm. Very interesting. And uh, how about uh, this fellow here? What about that? This is an early spearhead, too. Used, should have a shaft on it, yeah. and was used by primitive Canadian Indians for the taking of salmon. And uh, eventually the spearhead developed into the fish hook, is that right? That's right. The earliest ones were made of shell, bone, wood, or whatever material found in the locality. Mm -hmm. This rascal, with a slate shank and bone barb, catches fish, too. Very interesting looking. Some primitive tribes combined wood with shell or bone like this. Oh, my. And uh, here's one over here, kind of interesting. I noticed uh, these wooden hooks, for instance, can be quite elaborate, can't they? That's, that one. That's one of my favorites. It's a halibut hook used by Alaskan Indians. I guess that means that man has been fishing with a hook and line for a long, long time, eh? He sure has. To give you an idea, let's take a look at this picture on the wall. This is an Egyptian wall drawing done about 2,000 years before the Christian era. You get an idea of the evolution of fishing techniques we've been talking about from this other wall drawing that shows a man spear fishing. Yes, I guess fishing is one of man's earliest activities. But uh, primitive man, I guess he fished strictly for food, didn't he? Primarily, but uh, sport fishing is definitely an ancient art. Mm -hmm. 